Good evening. A scare at Kennywood today when the park's pirate ship ride malfunctioned and they couldn't stop it for about 10 minutes. And no one was injured, thankfully, but several of the riders were shaken up, frightened, and some became nauseous. Paul Martino spoke with some of those riders. He is joining us live from outside the park. Paul, good evening. Yeah, Julie, these riders are telling me they'll never get back on that pirate ship again. The giant ship-like ride swings back and forth like a pendulum. The problem today was the brakes failed. They couldn't get the ride to stop, and many people on the ride were frightened and sickened. The pirate ship is shut down, closed for operation, after giving way more of a thrill ride than anyone ever expected. I was terrified at the time. I mean, my kids are crying. There was um, people behind us panicking. Um, there was a guy in front of us. He was ready to get sick. And it just kept on going, and I just got really scared. And I was feeling really sick, and I was crying. I just, I, I was just terrified on it. This is how the pirate ship is supposed to operate. Controlled pendulum swings, left and right up and down. It's supposed to come to a nice controlled stop, but Wednesday they couldn't stop it. Uh, the ride's usually only about a two minute ride. We were on there at least 15 minutes. This man doesn't want to be identified, but says when they finally got off, the park was prepared for the worst. When the ride stopped, there was a team of mechanics out there um, escorting us off the ride, and also there was um, people from uh, EMT was there. Um, helping anybody that was sick. A spokesman for Kennywood calls it a relatively minor issue. They say the ride finally stopped using a secondary brake system. The ride's 35 years old. Kennywood says it has a good safety record. The pirate ship incident comes one day after the new Thomastown train went off the tracks. Kennywood says because of the newness of the ride, it still needs some adjustments. It reopened Wednesday. Meanwhile, riders trapped on the pirate ship say they may skip the ship next time. I will never go on that ride again. And again, no one was injured in the pirate ship mishap, but they were frightened, shaken up, and more than just a little bit sick. Reporting live from West Mifflin, Paul Martino, KDKA TV News.